Enzymes Enzymes are a substance that acts as a catalyst in living organisms, regulating the rate at which chemical reactions proceed without itself being altered in the process. The biological process that occur within all living organisms are chemical reactions, and most are regulated by enzymes. How the enzymes work? Lock and key theory. The lock and key theory explains the high specificity of enzyme activity. Enzyme surfaces accommodate substrate having specific shapes and size, so only specific substance fit in an active site to form enzyme substrate complex. Induced fit theory. A modification of lock and key theory called the induced fit theory proposes that enzyme have flexible conformations that may adapt it to incoming substrate. The active site adopts a shape that is complementary to the substrate only after the substrate is bound. Now, we are going to talk about the types of enzymes. According to International Union of Biochemistry and Molecular Biology, the enzymes are classified into main six categories as the following oxidoreductases, transferases, hydrolases, lyases, isomerases, and ligases. The first type is oxidoreductases. Oxidoreductase is an enzyme that catalyzes electron being transferred from one molecule to another. The transfer of electron means the transfer of hydrate of a hydrogen atom. Oxidoreductases include biological oxidation, dehydrogenases, oxidases, peroxidases, monoxygenases, dioxygenases, and one of these dangerous examples is converting pyruvate to lactate. Pyruvate dehydrogenase that removes two hydrogen atoms from pyruvate to convert it to lactate, and this happens to athletes, especially those who make violent exertion or in constant movements. The second type is transferases. Transferases are enzymes that catalyze the transfer of a functional group from a donor molecule to an acceptor molecule. Here groups transfer reactions occur, such as some of the following group, methyl group, carboxyl group, and so on. For example, aspartate transferase, that transfer the amine group from aspartate to alpha-ketoglutarate. The third type is hydrolases. Hydrolases are a class of enzymes that catalyze the hydrolysis of a chemical bond. Hydrolases include esterase, phosphatase, lipase, phosphodiesterase, peptidase. An example of the hydrolysis of a glucose 6-phosphate, which is done by action of a glucose 6-phosphatase enzyme. The fourth type, lyase and synthase. These enzymes remove the chemical group from the substrate. and instead creates a double bond within the substrate. This is what lyases do, as for the synthetase enzyme, add a group to the compound thus break the double bond in the compound, such as decarboxylase, aldolase. The first type is isomerases. The isomerases enzymes manufacture isomers from compounds, such as isomerase, racinase, and ebimerase. Another example in the chain reaction of glucose metabolism is converting glucose 6-phosphate to fructose 6-phosphate. This reaction is carried out by phosphohexose isomerase enzyme. This type is ligases and synthetases. These enzymes bind two parts together, breaking the phosphorus bond inside the ATP complex for similar compounds. And so, it can be known that there are special enzymes to manufacture compounds within the structure of the human body. For example, Factors that affect functions of enzymes. Number one, concentration of enzyme. Number two, concentration of substrate. Number three, effect of temperature. Number four, effect of BH.